Hello everyone, in this video we have solved a nice vital maths question c plus c plus c is equal to c times c times c c is equal to what? How to solve this maths question? It is interesting math and it is easy maths. So first of all you can see that c plus c plus c it will be 3c is equal to here is c times c times c it will be 1 1 1 so 1 plus 1 plus 1 it will be 3 so you can see this expression c to the power 3 now at this moment you can see here is c to the power 3 is equal to 3c i just move on this place now at this moment yes if i subtract both side minus 3c and here is 3c minus 3c i subtract both side 3c then you can see that this expression c to the power 3 minus 3c three is equal to 0 3c okay now at this moment you can see that here is c is common so this c cube divides c it will be c square minus 3c divides c it will be 3 is equal to 0 so we'll find out here is two case our first case c is equal to 0 look here is c is equal to 0 and other case c square minus 3 is equal to 0 now in this expression we know that a square minus v square it will be a plus v times a minus b if i follow this law this time i can see this expression it will be c square minus square root 3 whole to the power 2 is equal to 0 then if i apply this formula here this expression it will be c plus square root c times c minus square root c 3 is equal to 0. Now again we'll find out here is two case our first case is c plus square root 3 is equal to 0 and other case we'll find out c minus square root 3 is equal to 0. Now here c is equal to minus square root 3 I just move on this 3 in this side it will be negative 3 and here c is equal to square root 3 so we'll find out our final answer c is equal to 0 and c2 is equal to minus square root 3 and c3 is equal to square root 3 this is our final answer in this exponential expression okay so our question it will be c plus c plus c is equal to c times c times c this is our question and c is equal to here c is equal to 0 negative square root 3 and positive square root 3 now let's check out uh, if i take c is equal to 0 this time you can see that is 0 plus 0 plus 0 and 0 times 0 times 0 it will be 0 is equal to 0 so i can see that c is equal to 0 it is our right answer but here if you think c is equal to minus square root 3 so minus square root 3 plus and here minus square root 3 plus c it will be minus square root 3 is equal to minus square root 3 times minus square root 3 times minus square root 3 then you can see that this expression look here is 3 minus square root 3 so i can see that this expression it will be minus 3 square root 3 is equal to and here this time this you can see that it will be 3 because of that minus minus it will be positive uh, if i use here is look like same here square root 3 whole to the power 2 minus square root 3 then this this cancel and this is even number so minus power even number it is always positive so we are find out in this expression it will be 3 so 3 times minus square root 3 then this time this is equal to minus 3 square root 3 so i can say left hand side and right hand side is equal so c is equal to negative square root 3 this is our other answer and left hand side and right hand side is equal but again if you think c is equal to positive square root 3 I mean it is positive then I take here is c is equal to square root 3 plus c is equal to square root 3 plus c is equal to square root 3 then is equal to square root 3 times square root 3 times square root 3 because of that c is equal to positive square root 3 then you can see here is square root 3 is common so it will be 1 plus 1 plus 1 I mean this divide this it will be 1 this divide this it will be 1 this divide this it will be 1 
is equal to then you can see easily this expression it will be square 3 whole to the power 2 times square root 3 then we we'll find out here is 1 plus 1 plus 1 it will be 3 and here is square root 3 square root is cancel we we'll find out 3 square root 3 so left hand side and right hand side is equal so you can see easily here is um, c is equal to 0 c is equal to negative square root 3 and c is equal to square root 3 is our final answer thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care